So if you watch the other video, you know that um, I was trying to decide whether to keep the black or the blue. And I decided to go with the blue. I'm just making this extra little thing. Extra little video to show like the colors. I'm outside right now. I shut all the water off so there's not too much moisture in there. But the color is just like magnificent on these pages. I hope this camera can pick it. You see like the art gilding is like the light red. And it has like little blue flecks in it. It's really beautiful. I like this. I like this better now than the um than the gold trim. You know, the red and gold, the blue and gold. This paper is like a really like cream color. It's it's like a really off white, like almost beige. But it's really beautiful. I mean just a little extra thing, you know, just to show how it looks outside and you know, with the sunlight, it really picks up the colors. Really beautiful. But, yep. I decided to go with the blue. Only thing is... It's got, like, a little scuff right here on the front. I was kind of hoping... Yeah, maybe they would have noticed it and flipped it around. It would have been on the back. But, I mean, I guess that's just Allen Bibles, though, right? They're all kind of unique. They all have their little imperfections like we all do. So, just a little video for you guys. Right? I recommend getting one. They should probably still be up there. I don't think you'll regret it. The Bible has a beautiful feel to it. It smells great. Anyone who has an Allen knows that they smell great. But, alright, you guys take care. I'll see you.